I started because I had a dream that a society could be better when we work together. My name is Fikr Thadis. I am a fashion designer. My label is Yafika. Fikr means love in Ethiopia, so it's, it's my name. So it's my design and inspired by love. So <laughs> We started our label in 2009. I didn't have a degree in, in fashion. I actually took a little small courses, diplomas here and there. So I kind of like self-taught. <laughs> I think fashion is a, a self-expression for me. Most of the time shows how we feel and how we want to feel. And it says a lot about our identities. And I think it's how we can actually create who we are and we can show it to the world. Ever since I was designing, there's always been a dilemma where that to stay modern and to follow the modern uh, trends and to be cultural and to be in touch with your identity and all that. So I've always been experimenting a lot about what it means and how can I represent it in, in terms of garments and uh, cuts. I take a lot of inspiration from my old mother's dress cuts and also different tailoring techniques and also beadings and how they do it. So it's very important that they have that touch of culture, but they're still existing in the modern world. And it doesn't have to be too cultural, too modern or too something else. So it's kind of like what you want and we customize it to the need of a person, how much or how little they want it. So it's always an experiment. We have different parts of the country where they actually have authentic patterns, fabric types and authentic cuts in Ethiopia. We are actually creating a little bit of that culture and putting it into the modern and actually making it more comfortable and contemporary for the people. Majority of the custom made you know, like pieces are Ethiopians or affiliated with Ethiopians and we have a lot of diasporas and so we have a lot of range from young to older generation, but we also have people who are interested in the culture. We usually focus on uh, locally produced materials. I think Ethiopia is one of the places rich in cotton, and it's also part of the creating jobs and actually using all these amazing, talented weavers and embroiderers and all these people around, and it actually makes it very unique and very valuable. This is one of the things that I love about my designs is I actually want you to get excited about the dress so you don't really get bored. You could wear it like this or you can actually move it so you can have a dress where you can have a one shoulder or you could just put it here. You can put a, a press tab here so you can actually have fun with the dress and you can wear it for different occasions. This could be for a wedding, that could be for a Sunday brunch, or so you get to, to wear it more often. <laughs> we have had such a great, amazing journey. We didn't even plan it well. We just be there and feel it and we lived it. But now we're actually trying to create a more structured system where we actually produce more and we want to cater for the, for the world. In the next five years, I see a society changing because we worked with our hearts and with what best we had and we take all the good things that we can get from the world. And this is the whole rounded model functioning. So this is where my heart is right now. <laughs>